for Olympiacos. Can they build on it once again, having had AS Monaco go down the floor and not get a look at the bucket? What an offload. And the foul finishing through the contact on the inside. It's Costas Papa Nicolau with the feed out of the low post. Delightful vision. And how about that for a cut, catch, and completion on the inside by Costas Papa Nicolau. You know, Ron, I talked about the fact earlier they were playing a lot of face to face defense. So you want to talk about adjustments that are made at halftime? 16 2, the run overall in this third quarter. Oh, it's foul again out of the low post. Hooking up the cutting Isaiah Cannon. What a defensive possession by Thomas Walkup right there. He didn't give James anything. Almost got the steal from behind. Stopped the three point and made James give it up and then take a bad shot. And now, look at that. Foul rocking the rim on the cut to the buck. An Olympia course. Completely steamrolling AS Monaco. But as they demonstrated in the first half, AS Monaco have the shot makers to wipe out this deficit in a heartbeat, but foul catching in perfect position, clearing out defenders with the chicken wing. Transferring those skills to the basketball court. And for a foul as foul gets loose, count the bucket. And Mustafa foul wrecking shop on the inside at the expense of AS Monaco. And here's the play by Dante Hall, which is it's okay to make that play, but somebody from the other side, Mike James. Or Kobo has to come over and make sure that if you don't get that steal, you're going to block the path to the basket by fall. You can't get fall that easy of a look. But you talk about the two, the, the last three plays that we've seen so far, the cut back door by uh, by Papa Nicolau for the easy basket. They're leading this fourth quarter by four, 8-12 in their favor. Slukas dumps it down to foul, nice catch, and he rocks the rim once again.